Hello everyone, this is Nusrat. I wanted to make another video on this live episode of mine where my mom was um, diagnosed with COVID. She was a suspected COVID patient and she was hospitalized for 22 days. I have uh, uploaded a few short videos on it and uh, because of I was in such a mess uh, last 22 days, I couldn't really talk about it in detail. But right now, I would like to share with you all some very uh, insightful things I have seen, I have gone through the last few days. As you can uh, understand, it was a pretty wild journey for me and my family because, you know, mom was taken to ICU and uh, we always have this fear, you know, with the term ICU. But uh, Alhamdulillah, she came out fine. She had a very good recovery and now we're about to take her home. And before we do that, I just wanted to share some things with you all. Since she is over 60 years old and was already suffering from diabetes and there were lots of other complications, so there were definitely lots of um, frowns from different aspects. You know, people on my left and right suggesting different things or, you know, they all wished for the best. They all hoped for the best and perhaps they didn't get the same result. However, me as well as my family just kept on believing in the good days, on bringing my mother back home, on how it would feel like, on visualizing it. And ultimately that is what is happening right now. That's what happened afterwards. This was my first experience of being in a hospital where there is a lot of mourning, a lot of deaths, um, a lot of suffering besides being a lot of recovery. So what I wanted to tell you all is that, you know, a hospital is like um, another version of life, you know. On one side we have death and on the other side we have life. So on one side we have suffering and on the other side we have recovery. So I found it really fascinating. I mean, I could choose to, you know, look around me, look at people crying, look at all the deaths and have a fear in my heart. Instead, I chose to believe, I chose to have faith. And I feel like somehow that is what got rewarded because we attract what we believe in. I also feel like I came out of this entire experience much stronger, appreciating life a lot more because I have seen so many deaths past few days that I had never seen in my entire life. I feel like it's such a blessing to wake up every day to do your passion and you know when you're so near to death and you're so closely watch it you know you closely watch someone dying you have a new perspective of life and it is this new perspective that I wanted to share with you all life is an amazing gift and you know you will get whatever you want it does not matter how hard it is or how far away it seems to you but you're going to get it. You just have to have that faith in your heart. And whatever journey it is, just trust the process. I know I have been saying it a lot in my past few videos, but I have gone through this entire journey and I feel like this is how um, I have just totally transformed. I mean, I just let go and it's a miracle. So I wanted to give this uh, shout out to you all who may be suffering anything anywhere. Just don't give up and just keep going and just allow the transformation to happen. Come out a stronger person. Thank you.